Good morning, New Can Hill family. I'm Sheena. We're reading the Old Testament. Today we are going to read 1 Chronicles chapter 25. And it says here, Organization of the Orders of the Musicians. David and the army commanders then appointed men from the families of Asaph, Haman, and Jeduthun to proclaim God's message to the accompaniment of harps, lyres, and cymbals. Here is a list of their names and their work. From the sons of Asaph, there was Sakur, Joseph, Nathaniah, and Azvalah. They worked under the direction of their father Asaph, who proclaimed God's messages by the king's orders. Jeduthun had six sons, Gedaliah, Zerai, Jeshahiah, Shimei, Hashabiah, and Madahiah. They worked under the direction of their father, Jeduthun, who proclaimed God's messages to the accompaniment of the harp, offering thanks and praise to the Lord. Heman's sons were Bukiai, Mataniah, Uziel, Shebiel, Jeremoth, Hananiah, Hanani, Eliitha, Gedalati, Ramamataizer, Jobekasha, Malathai, Hothir, and Mehaziel. All these were the sons of Heman, the king's seer, for the God had honored him with fourteen sons and three daughters. All these men were under the direction of their fathers as they made music at the house of the Lord. Their responsibilities included the playing of cymbals, lyres, and harps at the house of God. Asaph, Jeduthun, and Haman reported directly to the king. They and their families were all trained in making music before the Lord, and each of them, 288 in all, was an accomplished musician. The musicians were appointed to the particular term of service by means of sacred lots, without regard to whether they were young or old, teacher or student. So the remaining of the chapter are some names from verse 9 to 31. It says, the first lot fell to Joseph of the Asaph clan and 12 of his sons and relatives. The second lot fell to Gedaliah and 12 of his sons and relatives. The third lot fell to Secure and 12 of his sons and relatives. The fourth lot fell to Zerai, the 12 of his sons and relatives. The fifth lot fell to Nathaniah and 12 of his sons and relatives. And this is going to keep going for a while here. The sixth lot fell to Bukiah and 12 of his sons and relatives. The seventh lot fell to Azrelah and 12 of his sons and relatives. The eighth lot fell to Jezehiah and 12 of his sons and relatives. The ninth lot fell to Metaniah and 12 of his sons and relatives. The tenth lot fell to Shimei and 12 of his sons and relatives. The eleventh lot fell to Uziel and 12 of his sons and relatives. The twelfth lot fell to Hashabiah and twelve of his sons and relatives. The thirteenth lot fell to Shubiel and twelve of his sons and relatives. The fourteenth lot fell to Medahiah and twelve of his sons and relatives. The fifteenth lot fell to Jeremoth and twelve of his sons and relatives. The sixteenth lot fell to Hananiah and twelve of his sons and relatives. The seventeenth lot fell to Joshbekshaha and twelve of his sons and relatives. The eighteenth lot fell to Hanani and twelve of his sons and relatives. The nineteenth lot fell to <coughs> excuse me, Melathai and twelve of his sons and relatives. The twentieth lot fell to Eliath and twelve of his sons and relatives. The twenty-first lot fell to Hothir and twelve of his sons and relatives. The 22nd lot fell to Gedalati and 12 of his sons and relatives. The 23rd lot fell to Mehaziah and 12 of his sons and relatives. And the 24th lot fell to Roma Mitiazar and 12 of his sons and relatives. So that is chapter 25. <clears throat> so I, um, yeah. I guess this is in relation to the musicians and all the, I guess the lots. I don't even know, honestly, what, who am I trying to fool? 
was all accomplished, the musicians were appointed to the particular term of service by means of sacred lots. Okay, so these are all these names I just read were musicians with regard to whether they were young or old. So the, I guess the lots were like their particular status within the, as far as what instruments they played, because it says appointed by their term of service. So there you have it. You can have family. God put it there. I read it and that's that. So we're going to be back tomorrow and it's talking about the organization of the gatekeepers and uh, chapter 26. So we'll see. And that's about have a beautiful, beautiful day. And always remember true healing begins with self love. Why? Because God is love and he lives on the inside of you. We'll talk soon. Bye.